Hi, I'm Jordine. Welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be doing another foundation wear test. Today's foundation wear test is going to be on the Maybelline Superstay foundation, which looks like this. So if you're interested in knowing my thoughts on the foundation, continue to watch and we'll get started. So this is what the bottle looks like. I have it in the shade 356 Warm Coconut. I got mine from Amazon. So um, it does have like this little sticky thing. Just take that off. It's like perforated, so take it off. And then the top looks like that, and it comes with a pump, which is a good thing. So I did wear this foundation yesterday, so I have my thoughts already, you know, developed, but I'm going to do an official wear test today and, you know, film it to show you guys. So um, I already have primer on. I'm using the Ren Perfect Canvas Primer, and I'm just going to pump it on my little dish. So I'm doing two pumps. So that's what the color looks like. So this is what half my face looks like. So this is what my full face looks like. So I'm done with everything. This is what the foundation is looking like. Like you guys, so I set my under eyes with the Maybelline uh, Fit Me Powder in 30 and my whole face I set with this Sephora Micro Smooth Powder. But y'all saw the close up after I was done applying the foundation and to be honest, this foundation is f flawless. Like, look at my skin. It looks really good. Like, I, I use two pumps. I don't think you need that much to be honest because it's completely full coverage. Um... It covered everything as you can see in the beginning. Um, I have a little bit of discoloration in my skin now because my skin is playing me. But that's okay. We're going to get it back together. Um, and it covered everything. Like, I didn't even have to go over a lot. Um, so, this right here looks really nice. It looks really nice. And I also set my face um, with the primer water from Smashbox because I'm a little bit more on the dry side. So, let's get in. To some information about the foundation. The foundation retails for $11.99 on Maybelline's website. They do carry it at Target and I got mine from Amazon.com. I got mine for $5. So I'm gonna link it below if it's still that same price. Um, it comes in 16 shades. So not a wide range of shades because I'm the third to the last shade and there are a lot of people darker than me. So hopefully they expand the shade range because the formula is really nice so far. So this is what everything is looking like. And I will check back in natural light so you can see how it really looks. Okay, so this is natural light. I'm heading to work, but this is what everything looks like. Real smooth, right? This we're at pores. Okay, so I'm back. It's the end of the night, pretty late. I feel like setting up, but this is what the foundation is looking like. So, as you can see, there's a little bit of crease in around the mouth. Not that deep though, and just a little frown line right there between the eyes. But other than that, I don't know if you guys can see, but it's pretty smooth. Still looks pretty good. Nothing has really faded on my skin. It's decent. So I've been wearing it for about 10 and a half hours now. It does claim to have a 24 hour wear. I don't know how I feel about that with the frown lines that are starting to come in. But you know, it looks pretty good. It did not give me an exact finish of the foundation, but it looks more of like a natural matte on my skin. A little bit of my oils are coming through on my nose now and in the middle of my forehead, but I actually like the finish of it. It looks really good. Very skin like, but the coverage is amazing. So, you know, for $11.99, I think it's a pretty decent foundation. So, if you're interested, I'm going to link it down below so that you can see any options for yourself. And that's going to be it for the video. If you have not, please subscribe to my channel and please give this video a thumbs up. And I'll see you in the next video.